Today, we're going to discuss something that's incredibly important, testing for pancreatitis at home. Pancreatitis is a serious condition that requires prompt medical attention, but early detection can make a big difference in treatment outcomes. So let's dive right in. First things first, let's talk about what the pancreas does. The pancreas is a vital organ responsible for producing enzymes that aid in digestion and hormones like insulin that regulate blood sugar levels. When the pancreas becomes inflamed, it leads to pancreatitis. Now let's discuss the signs and symptoms you should watch out for. These can include severe abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, fever, rapid pulse, and tenderness in the abdomen. If you experience any of these symptoms, it's crucial to seek medical attention immediately. Fortunately, there are some simple tests you can do at home that may indicate pancreatitis. One such test is a fecal elastase test. This test measures the levels of elastase, an enzyme produced by the pancreas, in your stool. Lower levels of elastase may indicate pancreatic insufficiency, which can be a sign of pancreatitis. To perform the fecal elastase test, You'll need a kit which typically includes collection containers and instructions. Follow the instructions carefully, collect a stool sample, and send it off to the lab for analysis. It's a simple and non-invasive way to assess pancreatic function. Another test you can do at home is monitoring your blood glucose levels. Pancreatitis can affect the pancreas's ability to produce insulin, leading to fluctuations in blood sugar levels. By regularly checking your blood glucose levels, you can spot any abnormalities that may indicate pancreatic issues. Using a blood glucose monitor is straightforward. You'll need a small lancet to prick your finger, a test strip, and the monitor itself. Follow the instructions provided with your monitor and remember to record your results for future reference. While these home tests can provide valuable insights, it's essential to remember that they are not a substitute for professional medical advice. If you suspect you have pancreatitis or are experiencing any concerning symptoms, please consult your healthcare provider immediately. They can conduct further tests, such as blood tests, imaging studies, or a pancreatic function test to confirm a diagnosis. That's all for today's video, folks. Remember, early detection is key when it comes to pancreatitis. So don't hesitate to take action if you're experiencing symptoms. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more valuable health tips. Take care, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.